Arcane, Season 1, Episode 2. So, I remember so little I'm realizing about this show. That's like good and bad because it means I get to enjoy it for the first time all over again. That said, some things are coming back to me. Some of the characters, some of the plot points. I just, I love Echo. I have a weird love for Silco as I'm sure we all do. But somebody in, in the comment section um, of my last, of episode one said, I was talking about tropes, said, well, this is a grim, dark world. They didn't say it that nicely. <laughs> but that's something I guess I didn't really consider. There is something I find very attractive about the grim dark world but i don't like it i like it when people are happy so i torture myself with these things because i like the grittiness but i want a happy ending and i just i'm not gonna get it but i did think that with like the trailer um for season two where where jinx has become an become an icon um that it was really interesting having the end of episode one uh with vi saying like this city's gonna know who we are whatever it is that she said that's super fascinating okay let's dive in i'm excited i feel like i'll need my emotional support pillow detective douche i remember that part and caitlin all oh, right this is the other side of it someone in there right not him or dinger's office oh I have no memory of this place. No, mom! Oh my god. I don't remember this at all. I'm so mad at myself for deleting the footage from this the first time I watched it by accident because I'd love to just rewatch that. I mean, I'm happy to rewatch the full episode, but I, but sometimes I like I forget how I understood things and this I have no memory of at all. Like who the hell is this guy? What happened here? Oh, I love Victor. It was an independent study. How am I dangerous? And yeah, that's for the council to decide. Hammerdinger, Humdinger. Fuck, what's his name? Yes! So cute! I do love a good conundrum, but sometimes... That's food in prison? No great science should ever put lives in danger. I'm 24. Ah! To be 24. I am now 307 years old. I am also 307 years old. Or at least these knees are. Does he Own your die? mistakes before the council. I yes. hope no. I can't remember. Speak nothing of magic. <laughs> Remind me why we bother with this dump. You worried Powder's gonna beat you again? If she didn't keep fixing these things, I wouldn't keep missing. If she didn't keep fixing, I wouldn't keep missing. Uh, I'm so torn. I'm like, good fucking job, Powder, but also she's a cuckoo bananas later. Top side of business ain't my concern. Hey guys. That got me good. I was well startled. You don't have anything on you from the job except powders friggin' think things. Oh shit, you have them actually on you. Oh my god, Milo. Over here! Yes, I go. You need to hide those crystals. No shit! I'm Evil beautiful lady? Crystals. That's it, it, well, that's a child's toy. <laughs> Good. Yeah, let's teach them what it means to mess with us! Don't do that. We look out for each other. It's the way it's always been. Do we get more backstory on him? I can't remember, but I, I kind of want it. You look weak. Like I'd love a Vander show? <laughs> He's so cute. Vander's gotta deal with the enforcers. What deal? For your birthday, counselor. I'm told it was built only for the sharpest of minds. <laughs> for a child. The drama! I remember that. He's gonna be like spotlit, right? So dramatic. Oh, is it all gonna close and I'm wrong? It's not that dramatic? Oh. Jace Talis. Oh, it's extra dramatic! <laughs> that must be the most annoying necklace in the world. Destroyed a building. If you were a scientist, you'd know you can't make a prototype without breaking a few wrenches. <laughs> <laughs> show for your work besides an explosion. Oh, right. Is he going to talk about magic now? I was trying to create magic. They can't be 
fabricated. Actually, I believe it is possible. Has anyone even tried it before? Oh. The arcane is the curse of our world. I am, it's coming back to me. That Hammerdinger just like knows what's gonna happen when people get involved in that, right? the wonders we could create. You don't understand what's at stake. It's a burden that only I here carry. Lays waste to civilizations. That cannot happen here, my boy. It must not. You may take your son home, Mrs. Tallis, but he is never to set foot on Academy grounds again. Mm. Jace is a beautiful idiot, huh? Too smart and not smart enough. First time I've been invited to the lanes. You're looking for four children. I'm about to make your day. How? I could have convinced the council. You could not have. My own family won't help me. I'll find someone who will. Oh, I hate stupid people. I mean, he's intelligent, but not smart, you know? If dangerous ideas didn't excite the imagination, they would never wander astray. Could it work? Could these stones really invoke magic? Uh, this is how you're gonna disintegrate your friend, Victor. What? No, 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 it'll kill me. Power, real power, doesn't come to those who are born strongest. It comes to those who will do anything to achieve it. I won't do anything. I'll do a little bit. I wouldn't do it. I don't know that he feels like he has a choice. You're gonna monster him in your laboratory? Why wouldn't you monster him outside your laboratory? Monster him outside, he's gonna break things. They won't see you. Your name's no good now. We can't be friends anymore. So why are you out here? I'm a misfit too, I suppose. Come inside, Caitlin. Aww, poor guy. You said guy. this was a robbery. You take anything dangerous. Ooh, I like how they're all standing. That was a beautiful like. picture. Let's turn the undercity upside down if you have to. Not nice. What can I get you? Dodge the place. Where are they hiding? <gasps> Hold on! Ah! Close the fucking door! I can't remember what happens! <sighs> but we all know there is a crime behind every coin that passes through this place. Whose fault is that? Why you guys You're with all the money? Yo, that's tough. such a you tough okay? spot. I feel like I'm remembering thinking Powder should have been left with Echo. Like she was by herself and Echo just disappears for that part of the show. So I feel like they, if they're doing fan service or they're doing introduce him now for later, we shouldn't see him as much. He shouldn't be here now if he's not going to be here to help Powder later. I can't remember exactly if they gave a reason why he isn't there and why she's left actually on her own. Maybe I can't remember, but like he shouldn't be in this scene. There's no reason for Echo to be in this scene. And it enforces the idea that he's a good friend and that he's around a lot. So then why wouldn't he be around when Powder is left alone? I can't remember. Maybe I'm getting mad over nothing. And if you won't, I will. I've heard this kind of talk before. What I don't understand is how you can work with them. What are we gonna do? I, I don't know. I'll figure it out. Yes, I've decided I would like a full show about Vander and Silco and everything that happened before. And that show can end with him finding Vi and Powder. Thank you. Please make happen. Yes. What? Bro, it's not that deep. Am I interrupting? The hell's your problem? What's that? Another list with my name on it? Only because you signed your notes. Every page, I might add. A little egotistical, don't you think? Because I think you're onto something. I don't even know your name. It's Victor. You guys can't tell me they don't have chemistry. I feel like I said this before and nobody liked it, but they are gay for each other. Bye. where you been? Rumor is the lanes are gonna fight. Do you have any idea what you've done? I was getting results. There is no stopping what happens now. Maybe it's not too late. That's cool and jarring that it's from the beginning of the, the show. Oh no. Why can't we all just be nice to each other? Oh, the monster. Oh, she's in there? Oh, where's the monster? Ah! Luckily, I have time to watch the next episode right now! <laughs>
yeah, I don't really got too much to say right now because I feel like I just want to get to the next episode to see if my echo thing is right and that he shouldn't have been in that scene and that it doesn't make sense that Powder wasn't left with him. Uh, also, I'm firmly saying that I need more Vander, uh, but I would love a show just about Vander. Let me know what you guys think and I hope you guys are all happy and healthy, taking care of yourselves and each other, being friends instead, unlike these people.